Hello, I'm Dave with Boss Laser. We're going to be going over the Generation 4 alignment now. There are a couple different parts with aligning the machine that you need to know about. One is the tube placement in the back. You can see it's uh, located on, on top of the brackets and leveled out. The laser fires to mirror one right here, which reflects off this mirror to mirror two which reflects right there to mirror three, which is the laser head. And from there it shoots down onto your material. You're gonna take your painter's tape, rip off two small pieces, stick them together, take that and place it over mirror one. Go ahead and fire on your first mirror and should leave a dot. As we can see here, the mirror left a dot directly in the center of the mirror. It doesn't have to be necessarily directly in the center, but as long as it's hitting the mirror, you should be fine. Next, we're going to be aligning it to mirror two. What you're going to do is move the, the Y all the way to the back gantry. Take two more pieces of tape, stick them together, and put it over mirror two. Okay, with your mirror all the way to the back of the y-axis, go ahead and pulse it once. Then move the mirror all the way to the front axis. And fire it again. In these two shots, this one was our first one. And we need to align this dot to this dot. So we need to raise the screws on the mirror to match up to here. Okay. This is your first mirror. Then we want to line the two dots up. Always the first dot to the second dot and you're going to move that second dot. To do that, we know that we know that the first dot is lower, so we need to raise it. This one right here, screw right here raises it. This one moves diagonal and this one moves left and right. Now we know we need to come up, so we want to loosen this screw. And we know we need to go to the left a little bit, so we loosen this screw. So now to check to make sure that that mirror is aligned, take two more pieces of tape again, place it over the mirror, move the mirror to the back of the y-axis pulse it and move the mirror to the front axis again pulse it and they're both hitting now on the same dot now we're going to be aligning mirrors two and three three is located at the top of the laser head take your two pieces of tape Place it over the top, kind of give an impression so you can see the circle. This is important that dot hits directly in the circle. Go ahead and pulse the laser. When you do that, you want to make sure that that dot is directly in center of the hole. Since this is in center, we're going to move it all the way to the right. Pulse it again. You see we're off a little bit. So it needs to come up and to the left. If your dot is focusing to the left or the right on the third mirror, you must move your second mirror back and forth in this direction. Doing that, Use your T-square, however far you need to go over, hold it there, loosen these screws, and you can move it back to and from. It's important that this stays square, though. Okay, now we're going to go over the functions of the laser head. 
when the laser head hits, when the laser itself hits the mirror three, hits that mirror and shoots directly down. We take out this magnetic dust cap and the housing. Opens the area up. Take two pieces of tape again. Stick them together. Place them over that. Go ahead and pulse once. And it should be firing directly in the center. Right above your lens. Now if it were to be firing to the left, we know that the laser is shooting too high in, on mirror three. Because it's hitting the high part and coming down on the left. If it's shooting to the right, that means the mirror's come the laser's coming in too low and hitting on mirror three. To correct this, there are two screws right here. Using your three millimeter, you can loosen these up and move this head up and down. It's a lot easier than our past models. To test the true alignment of the machine from the third mirror down, take your piece of half an inch acrylic, place it under the laser head, auto focus it. And go ahead and fire it. As you can see right there, we got a good aligned laser. And that's it for aligning your Generation 4 laser machine. Have a good day.